Question 16. There are four shapes on this diagram. So we've got two circles and then an R shape and an L shape. It says the diagram is turned to the new position below. So it's turned to there. Now as you can see, some shapes are missing. So what we've got to do is draw the three missing shapes. Now there's a very simple trick we can do to solve this problem. So if we get some tracing paper and trace this shape, shouldn't take us any longer than 30 seconds. Here's one I made earlier. So as you can see, I've traced that shape. All I need to do is bring my tracing paper down onto the grid then, and it should be the same size. And then what I need to do is rotate it. So if I rotate it until I get this L shape down here in the bottom middle square, we can see where the missing shapes need to be. So the circle needs to go there, the other circle needs to go there, and the other L or R shape needs to go there. So all you need to do then is just move your tracer paper off so you can see where they've got to go and draw them. So just move that toolbox out of the way and get a pen to draw with. We should be in business. Okay, so the circle needs to go on the top left square. There we go. This is kind of like a back to front R. It needs to go on the top right square. So we need a back to front R on the top right square. And then we need another circle just underneath that. And that's it. With a piece of tracing paper, you should make it nice and easy. You can just pop your tracing paper back on to make sure you've got the shapes in the right place. And there we go. Job done. Tracing paper saves the day.